6am on the excavator move. And the friction boss John predicted is about to erupt. When I heard Wayne was on the job, I thought oh, this is a bit extra work for the other boys because Wayne doesn't like to get his hands too dirty. On this job, Keith is Wayne's boss. Keith. I've had a few issues with Keith. Unless you're prepared to get your hands dirty, you might as well just go run up down the highway and cart a fridge van. I really think he must have just been a schoolyard bully. I think he's one of those fellows that would go and steal your lunch. Pick on you. Probably not a bully, I'd just speak honestly. Some people don't like the honest truth. If someone's going to stand around and do nothing and we're get, they're getting paid the same money as us, well, of course I'm going to say something to them. Also on this job are veteran drivers Fredo and Keith's dad, Bevan. All four must pull together if they're to deliver a giant excavator 700 kilometres to a mine site. You're working in remote western Queensland where the roads are five and a half, six metres wide. You're nearly eight metres wide. We've got narrow bridges to go across with minimal clearance. We've got deadlines to meet. There's 101 things that can go wrong on this move. 